We have a tier list for you guys to start with today of the funniest moments of the NBA season. You know, it's not last year where we had potentially the funniest season of NBA history. It was ridiculous. Facts. But we got some gems this year. There's 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 some moments to talk about. It should be good. Let's do 100%. it, bro. <laughs> Let's go. Tier listing is our thing. <laughs> yep. We've never made a bad one. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be a Reddit and we never made a good one. <laughs> <laughs> I have, I think this is like 11 moments pulled up. Real simple. We're going to put them in a tier list, S through F, based on how funny they were. And I think it's only right we start with Jimmy Butler getting the emo haircut. Started the season off with a bang. Where are we putting this? This has this to is be S tier. We got it 5 million views off of this, bro, right here. I must say this <laughs> is tier. I was singing on camera for the first time, bro, for my entire life. Got me, re- got me reciting Randy Orton lines. S tier like a motherfucker. Peak troll. <laughs> Listen, in terms of content, there's never been a funnier moment than this, I don't think. This is peak. It got to be S tier. Yeah, the <laughs> fact that it was so unexpected that we j- he just showed up that way makes it S tier. We should have expected it, given his track record of uh, interesting hairstyles, but we never did. And that's what makes it so great. I agree. Next year, I need to see him with the complete shiny. <laughs> <laughs> Bald headed Jimmy would be crazy. Yeah. I need, I need him no, on spiky Richard Mohawk. Jefferson type timing, bro. <laughs> <laughs> All right, all right. Next up, Giannis and his game ball fiasco against the Pacers. Listen, oh my God. this is this is Esther to me. I've never seen a grown man freak out like this. I've never seen anybody. <laughs> you just, must not hoop at LA Fitness often. I'll tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I think you freak out like this. <laughs> exactly. He does for no, sure. No, 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 no. Not like not like this. This is a different level. This is a different level. Running back and forth. Giannis freaked out so bad that the Pacers were like, we need to hire a black belt to defend Tyrese Halliburton. They hired an a kicker. professional fighter to protect them against Giannis. That's how crazy he was. This is S tier. Facts. <laughs> they had to hire John Wick to come protect Halliburton. That's what I mean, that man the next day. That was crazy, bro. <laughs> we're going S tier or A tier. I think it should be S, bro. The repercussions of it is, is hilarious. And it was proved he was wrong. <laughs> he was wrong. Like they had the right ball the whole time. Yeah, I think I think that's what makes it makes it an S tier. That he went through this for 30 minutes for them to just say, bro, what are you doing? You, you we gave you the ball already. We gave you the ball. Loud and wrong. Right. Yeah. S tier is the right way. Relax. Okay. Next up, Kenny, what do you think about this one? Draymond choking out Rudy Gobert. I, can we can everything be S tier? I mean, this this is a seven foot one player that was getting choked out, but he it looked like he did not care at all. He's looking at the ref, pointing at Draymond like the ref can't see that Draymond is choking him right now. Like it, it is the best thing because we know that Draymond has hated Rudy Gobert for a long time, and Draymond's green, green's eyes lit up when he saw an opportunity to choke this man out. It's S tier. Draymond was spamming buttons and fatalities on him. It was ridiculous. Yeah, Rudy Gobert could have smelled the wrong way, bro, and or just breathed the wrong way, and and Draymond would have done the same exact shit. He was looking for any reason, any excuse to do that. That's an S tier moment. If that was Nas Reed in that kerfuffle instead of Rudy Gobert, Draymond oh, nah. Green wouldn't have done a damn thing. Nah. <laughs> he picks and chooses for sure. Okay. Well, what about two weeks later, Draymond Green punching the shit out of Yusuf Nurkic and getting indefinitely suspended? All right, that's not uh, an S. It's, it's, not, it's not, not an S. It's more A for like annoying because it's like, <laughs> it's just crazy because he got suspended and then came right back, did the same thing. It's like, did, no. do you not learn Repeat anything? Offender. Like, bro, two <laughs> weeks later? Come on. Have some discipline. Like no, this is this is the time where it, it turned it was the opposite of funny. We I was thinking, like, does bro really need to hit the therapist? Like mm-hmm. this funny choking I say a man out. for better help, bro. <laughs> but the, the other the other stuff two weeks later, we like get bro help, please. This is not funny at all to me. <laughs> That's what Kevin Durant was saying. Like, damn, is he gonna ruin his legacy? Right. <laughs> One punch at a time. <laughs> Okay, we can go A tier for annoying. I like that. What about Andre Drummond trying to dunk Tory Craig's self oop? <laughs> this this was funny to y'all. <laughs> I, I was watching this and I just I couldn't I couldn't believe what I was seeing. I couldn't believe what I was seeing. The last five years of Bulls fandom, this is this is the moment. This shows us exactly what we've been through every single night. <laughs> Is this one of the top five dumbest plays y'all have ever seen in the NBA? Maybe top, maybe top two. 
And I, I watched JaVale yeah, McGee's Rushmore. entire career. I watched JaVale McGee's entire career. I was going to say, yeah. That, that's why I said top Rushmore. five. That's, that's why I said top five. I respect greatness. I respect what JaVale McGee has done in the Shaq in the Fool game, <laughs> right? He has moments. So I don't, I don't want to disrespect that. I was going to say, if we got a Mount Rushmore of bad plays, we got Dr- Drummond up there, and then JaVale McGee with three different expressions. Drummond is not even the problem. Why is Tory Craig trying to self lock? <laughs> there is no like explanation for that. He does. He doesn't deserve to have that type of. He like, thinks he's playing was, park. He's on it 2K. was so out of pocket. That's why Drummond jumped because he had never seen Tory Craig try to act like this before. It <laughs> must be for me because I've, like I've never seen him dunk. I've never seen him. This got to be eight tier. This is ridiculous. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and the Drummond hurt himself doing this. That's ridiculous too. <laughs> that is hilarious, man. <laughs> he was Me out too. for like four days. <laughs> 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 he had to go home and rest his foot because Tory <laughs> Craig wanted to be stupid. <laughs> <laughs> we got James Harden contesting Kawhi Leonard's three point shot and Kawhi getting mad at him about it. <laughs> Bro. It's funny. It's it's funny because it's, it's James Harden because like LeBron did this a couple years ago like he faked block R- Rondo shot and everyone was like look at the team chemistry they're so together <laughs> and Kawhi Leonard is like bro get out of my way like what are you doing leave like it's it's hilarious like I'm close to fifty forty ninety and this is what you're doing to me <laughs> no facts that's true. <laughs> You said you have playoff fraud allegations, and this is how you want to build chemistry. <laughs> Ridiculous. Yeah, no, this is. It's so funny because that's that's such a clear difference between LeBron James and Kawhi Leonard as players. Mm. LeBron's like, haha, it's one random play. We're all good. Kawhi's like, every play I must dominate. Every play I must murder. Get out of the way. <laughs> and they kind of needed that three pointer too, bro. Like when LeBron did it. It was for fun. It was just a layup, and Rondo made it or whatever. But this is the corner three. And like an important game because they're fighting for playoff seating. James Harden, <laughs> you don't deserve to do that when you're fighting for your life here. That's the best part. Like, what what compelled James Harden to do that? It wasn't a layup or was going in regardless. He had serious impact on the shot. What was going through Kawhi's mind? Like, as he's loaded up, he's just like, he's getting closer. He's getting closer. Why is he here? Like, <laughs> I need to hear his point of view. This is just like a intrusive ADHD thought. Yeah. He's like contest. Like, he just has to yeah. do it. <laughs> It's A tier, at going? least. A <laughs> tier it is. I'll put a C because I'm still mad for Kawhi. <laughs> he missed. <laughs> All right, we got Steph Curry going up for a jump ball with Victor Wembanyama. I'm not going to lie. This is not funny. This is like the video of Kelsey Plum like eating popcorn where she's trying to be quirky. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and she's just like, ah. Like, no. It's not, it's not funny. It's not funny. <laughs> <laughs> Steph Curry wants to go viral so fucking bad every time he touches the court every time he can he's doing his little taunts he's playing to the crowd trying to get viral clips like this this is hilarious because he's so shameless about wanting to be on every Instagram page there is <laughs> so I'm gonna make HOH with this one. Oh my god <laughs> that was the highlights broke NBA players bro <laughs> I'm not doing this that was not funny he said Real's gonna love this yeah <laughs> <laughs> this is a D, man. Yeah, he's hilarious. My kids an F. Never mind. I changed my mind. You're right. <laughs> Steph, get a grip. <laughs> <laughs> All right, last but not least, we got Zion Williamson smirking when he got asked what he's going to do in Vegas during the in-season tournament. <laughs> nah, this is a nasty <laughs> guy. <laughs> this is a nasty guy. And he knows it. What are you he's, think? He's, he's embraced his personality. <laughs> and I love that for <laughs> Yeah, getting asked what you're going to do with money and, and looking so menacing is always a recipe for disaster. <laughs> so and genius. not only did he do that, Brandon Ingram looked at him knowing that he does some crazy <laughs> stuff with his money. <laughs> Brandon Ingram was like, we've seen the Twitter threads. We know what goes on. <laughs> Disgusting brothers for real. <laughs> Facts. <laughs> so I'm familiar with your game. <laughs> <laughs> that's team chemistry right there yeah that, that is. is true <laughs> a S tier good b b yeah b's fine b yeah and those are the funniest moments of the nba season does anybody else have any honorable mentions that i forgot about Just yesterday twitter season. thought the twitter ai thought clay thompson was actually throwing bricks and they wrote a fake <laughs> an ai news story about him throwing bricks in public that was funny <laughs> that was that's embarrassing funny. bro <laughs> 
<laughs> Elon, what have you done to my favorite app? <laughs> oh, I don't even want to get into that kind of worms. 